все удобно. Я. Yeah. You, you want to tip it? What you need? Tip it? Yeah, okay. Okay, thank you. Second floor, yeah. Yes, hi, I'm Nathan. I'm Rabbi from New Brighton Jewish Center, also doctor in Konyal Hospital. We're preparing for holiday of suitcase, building our holiday tent, also car for celebration, to demonstrate our belief in God, that we can live in the temporary tent for a few days. I need to think from both ways as a rabbi and a doctor, so my responsibility to provide safety for anybody who come to pray to the synagogue on high holidays so we are careful that we keep social distancing while praying i think all challenges just make us stronger so our prayers should be different too from the regular prayers when we have challenges like not like personal challenge but challenge for everybody and our prayers is not only for us it's all for all world because we believe that rosh hashanah is a judgment day for everybody in the world. So we pray for all humanity to overcome this challenge, it becomes stronger after the challenge will be in the past. If you want, you can go inside the scene of your... This is social distancing. You see, this is social distancing in practice. <laughs> Usually we have 200 people praying here on, a, on Yom Kippur. The people come specially to say memorial prayer Easter for their relatives, like for departed relatives. But this year, because I have pre preference of people's safety, so we made it short. People came specially for prayer for like half hour, 20 minutes. <coughs> the chauffeur uh, was used during the high holiday service conducted on Guam in the Western Pacific in 1945. Like I left Russia when I was 19. The Russia was very like anti-Semitic country generally. It was like government supported anti-Semitism. It has like limitations for Jewish people. Look, you have kids who like who just uh, want to beat you just because you are Jew. You don't think you see it so much in growing in Brooklyn. And it's probably different or like treat you differently just because you're Jewish which is really illegal in Russia because officially it was like countries that consider every nationality should be equal but in reality when this wow. regime preach right. something right. they're doing completely different things they preach freedom and it was much more one of most oppressive uh, country probably in the world Do this, so sometimes I pray in a hospital in a place where I sit with other residents. Some of them like Muslims, some of them Christians, but we all same team. So I sometimes pray there. It's not different. It's like it's very, it's very easy to be like it's in, especially now in United States we live in such uh, open society you can believe in anything that you want as long as you act professionally everybody is welcome <laughs> 